Hey guys, how's it going? So, Yoko here again. I just wanted to make another video to first of all congratulate you guys on the huge win of Trump Senpai! So when Trump Senpai won Indiana, it was in the morning here, so um, I was um, on my way to go attend a meeting here and I was on the train and I was scrolling down Facebook because I'm a kind of an old person I still use Facebook and I was scrolling down and then I saw the news of Ted Cruz suspending his campaign and I was like oh my god yeah I was like oh my gosh like this is becoming real you know like at the time Kasich was still in the race but still like I'm like this is happening really I remember all the liberal people and even the, like the Republican people saying like oh like he'll drop out soon and things like that and I'm sorry it's shaking it's just me shaking because I'm so excited and I have the power to shake the camera and all the Republican candidates are suspending their campaign meaning that they haven't dropped out so um, um, I saw a lot of people commenting like you know uh, like you guys still need to vote like go vote you know it's not official so like go freaking vote and I saw a bunch of um, comments like that and at the same time um, I saw a lot of people saying like oh you know Republican Party have to has to unite all I can do is just to you know wish that everything will go as it should so wishing the best for our great friend America. Anyways, I hope that you guys are excited to see all these Japanese papers. And um, yeah, that's how many articles there are about Trump's empire. Isn't it crazy? Like, I mean, this is Japan, right? And we're not occupied anymore. That's a, such a bad joke, but I'm um, so... Uh, it's kind of interesting to see like um, the another uh, country's election on the top page, you know, like it's the biggest news here. You know what I mean? Okay, so... If any of you are curious, that's what I'm seeing right now. <laughs> so you see, this is why it shakes sometimes. But anyway, so here I have um, six different kinds of the newspapers here. This is the only local one that I got. So yeah, there are so many other newspapers here, but um, these are the main ones. So um, yeah, let's see. So this is how it's gonna work. So I'm gonna introduce like the most conservative papers and then gradually it's going to be like liberal papers. So yeah, be ready for that. So this is Sankei Shinbun and they are the best we can do. <laughs> it's not even like nationalistic or right-wing or anything. It's kind of conservative enough in my opinion. Toram, but this is the um, name Trump and <laughs> Cruz, <laughs> Cruz is suspending his campaign. Okay, so the entire article here, like on the top page, is this size. This is big, right? Like the most of uh, the article is about Trump's and by winning. So basically, this article is talking about you know what happened in the election campaign and then uh, all the um, stuff like boring stuff. It doesn't really have the content. And but one thing to note is that this is saying that um, Japan is, is kind of in a difficult position, which I agree actually. You see the picture here, so that's Ted Cruz, right? And so this is all about oh, how far does it go to here and over here. It's Sitoram, but Trump Senpai and the awesome picture here and. Um, <laughs> these pictures and the comparison of, you know, where they are from, like when they were born and on the career, family and policy and things like that and the characteristic and um, so, oh, this is from CNN too. <laughs> That's funny. This guy has to do that too. So this is all US election, this section and also up here, uh, this is all America. That is huge! So this article here is talking about that the Japanese government has to be prepared for Trump's empire. Like, you know, he might... because it, it says here that, oh, if he becomes a president, so, um, yeah. And then LDP Politchin is, um, saying that, uh, we need to get ready, like, as for, uh, security treaty and, um, all the deals and stuff. And then over here, they're talking about like Trump's empire kind of changing the tone of when he talks. 
you know, and then uh, uh, the people might not be voting and stuff. Here is saying that the Republican Party is basically um, broken <laughs> and stuff. Okay, let's hurry because we have a lot of cover here. And this is the last article of Sankin Shibun. And why did they pick this picture? I don't know, but Ivanka looks good. <laughs> this is actually the series that they are doing. Like it's, it says, uh, uh, the path to the White House. And it's been a series, and they write about uh, the presidential campaign of the US like every day. So, yep, 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 yep. Okay, so we have five more to go, just so you know. <laughs> I hope you guys won't be tired. But, um, Stay with me, please. Okay, so the next one is Nippon Kiesa Shimbun, and these two letters mean economy. So this is an economy-based newspaper. And you see Trump's empire, there they are, with Hillary Clinton. And so, yeah, this is seeing the battle here already, I guess. And this is actually huge. So this goes here, 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 here. And then... So it's, it's like half of the newspaper like top page so that's cool and yeah again this is the biggest news in japan yep and it, they're talking about the uh delegates and you see cnn and the schedule is there and not really talking about anything much just that you know what happened and again cruz is um suspending his campaign and the trump senpai is winning i mean the he, he'll be the nominee and stuff so Okay, so it goes like all up to here, and then so it's like all this area. So that's huge. They're talking about like comparing the two people's uh, like Trumps and Biden, Clintons tax, like you know how they are different, and talking about uh, TPP and um, security treaties issue like diplomacy and now the Japanese government is watching out for Trump's empire. I've been saying this since summer or fall last year though like we need to be prepared for Trump's empire right as for like security treaty and stuff like because there will be changes and and that we have to make sure that we can get the budget and everything like that and I've been telling the Japanese people here and now the government is like oh my god we have to get ready I'm like <laughs> Are you kidding me? So they will get prepared soon, and this is talking about uh, vice vice president issue and stuff. Mm, not saying much, uh, just a Republican Party person probably and stuff. And then here, specialists are saying that um, Trump senpai might actually become the president. And over here, they're talking about the economy issues and terrorism in the United States and. You know, it's like a huge problem. And then over here we have another picture. Wait, she's a little prettier here. Trump Simba is, well, kind of cute. <laughs> so it's like, um, yeah, so so this article is basically saying that Trump Simba is a great um, businessman. And this one is, um, you know, a uh, politician with a lot of career and stuff and they're comparing the um, background again like when they were born where they're from their religion and all that kind of jazz and then <laughs> and this one is saying that the Chinese people are kind of feeling threatened or something like that it's, which is interesting this article is this big yeah up to here so yeah it's kind of a, a lot in one Japanese newspaper so this is Yomiuri Shimbun. You see the uh, English letters. So Yomiuri Shimbun is kind of okay, you know. They're not liberal, but they are not conservative either. But the Prime Minister Abe, the current one who is uh, actually a conservative, is, I think, that he is kind of working on this newspaper, like uh, kind of pressuring them or something like that. Not pressuring, but like he's good friends with the... Um, CEO or whatever. So this newspaper is not bad and my father likes it because it has a lot of information but I don't know what to think <laughs> honestly. But so anyways so Trump Senpai is actually the second article here because the top one com comes here in Japanese articles I mean uh, newspapers. So but still we have Trump Senpai here. Oh what a happy face. Okay, so so they have the picture of uh, all the delegates and stuff, and it is as big as this. And how far does it go? 
it stops here. So it's this size on Yomi with Shinbos. And they have three more articles as well. And the first one is here. All right, it's in one, two articles here. Okay, so it's as big as this. This is in... So over here is all about the U.S. About you guys. Yay! And Trump senpai. Again, a happy face. <laughs> I like the Yomiuri Shimbun's choice. Yeah, good job, Yomiuri. And over here we have the history of Republican Party, like, you know, since, uh, since this date. So, yeah, it's interesting. A lot has happened, guys. We have come this far. Oh, it's talking about where the vote of Cruz is going and stuff. So over here, it's interesting that they are using the huge fonts, you know, it's big. It's a big title. <laughs> and it's important because it's talking about the Japan-US security treaty and that Trump's empire might change it. So, um, yep, so the government is now um, hurrying to build a connection with the U.S. Yeah, I'm like, hey, look at me, government. I'm doing better than you. <laughs> because you guys are there for me. And I'm like, yeah, I, I have friends in the U.S. You guys should join, too. Da -da -da! That's a great picture, too. You happy, Trump senpai? This woman is. Okay, so it's a huge article here as well. So this goes here. And here up to here, I'm oh, talking of Panama, Panama paper. This is all the U.S. Oh my God, it's big. It's interesting because um, the it says that rather than policies, it's about uh, the skills of speech, which I think is interesting because I mean, uh, Trump senpai of course has great skills when he talks, but that doesn't mean that what he's saying. Like the policy is lacking stuff, but it, sa it says here that um, there's no specifics and he says, trust me. And I'm like, I don't know, isn't there like a cul cultural difference? Hmm, like Trump senpai has ideas. It's not like he's clueless and he has all the professionals around. And I'm like, hmm. It's saying that the angry voters will be on his side and that will Cruz. Poor Cruz is suspending his campaign, and so this one apparently is um, New York newspapers of like you know um, the Republican figure here is dead or something. Yeah, I'm like, dude, of course. <laughs> and over here they're talking about the schedule and how the election works from now on and things like that. So the next one is Minus Shimbun, and again, this is turning a little further to the liberal side, and Minus Shimbun has a lot of problems, like a lot of conservative people here hate this newspaper. I personally can't really judge because I do hate their past, which is that they were talking negatively about Japan in English, like this awful, I think he was a white guy from Australia or something like that? I don't remember exactly, but this dude was writing all the nonsense, like crap, like all lies about the Japanese culture, like saying that we're like kinky kind of people, like kinky and um, erotic, and what you call like a dirty tribe or whatever. And we were, we got really angry, so we called this newspaper hentai, <laughs> like a pervert. So yeah, that's how much the conservatives here hate this newspaper. But personally. I am thankful for this newspaper because sometimes they um, write about the projects that I am involved in, you know, the Corsair thing and the um, the Japanese flag that's returned from the young guy in the United States and stuff. They wrote about it, so I'm like, yeah, they're actually nice and that's what I think, but I don't know, I'm not gonna judge. So the top news here is about the earthquake, which I don't mind, but still the second um, news is Trump sent by. See again, it's the same phrase everywhere. <laughs> so Trump's senpai is now the nominee and Cruz is spending and um this is actually not the big like it's so that's how big or small. But still on the top page, so that's cool. No pictures though. And <laughs> see they have two more articles. Which is kinda sad. It's, okay. 
So inside we have this article and it's as big as the na 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 it goes up to here. So it's kind of big. And this is saying that the Republican Party is having a hard time uh, uniting and stuff. And um, this is talking about Cruz. And did you guys see that video of Ted Cruz punching his wife with his elbow and stuff while ha trying to hug his father or whatever? Uh, like. I felt so bad watching that, like, the, his, his wife, like, he was hugging his wife first, and then they were like, oh, right, like, so sad moments, and then, uh, <laughs> crumb clumsy Cruz, like, next, um, hugged the guy, and he's like, <laughs> like, <laughs> beat the wife, and I felt so bad. And, um, these two professors over here, so this person is saying that what fuels the voters is the um, distrust in politics and this guy is saying that um, um, what matters is the vice president and stuff, which is interesting. Oh wait, one thing to mention is that um, it's talking about like Trump and Biden talking bad about the um, other candidates, right, like Lion Ted and Little Marco and um, it's uh, this article is saying that um, because of that like some republican voters went away and something like that or that they will not vote for the election like i understand if you don't like the idea of trump sent by kind of being harsh in the election campaign um election campaigns are kind of not no a normal situation so i'm like dude like that's a clever strategy of Trump's and by so I'm like I wouldn't get away from the Republican Party but um it's so stupid like so they don't vote and basically they're encouraging the Democratic Party to take over I'm like dude vote for Trump's and by for your own sake and the world so that's all for my Nishi Shimbun and then we have Asahi Shimbun right here so Asahi is such a liberal like a super liberal <laughs> newspaper that conservative people freaking hate. So a lot of the awakened people here hate this newspaper company, but uh, the reason why is because they lie a lot. Like they're super liberal and they lie when it comes to history and stuff. So like they believe that Japan was such an atrocious country and things like that which is war guilt information program and it's interesting because they used to be a good newspaper company but after the war like right after the war when the occupation period started or maybe a little before like they immediately changed you know to like they were kind of like they were writing good stuff about Japan and then they instantly changed their policy so yeah and then it's a shame that um, they couldn't go back to the normal status after the occupation period, but um, yeah, they started to be a liberal since then. There are so-called comfort, comfort women issue here, and they started the lies, and it was picked up uh, by the lawyers here, who became the politicians later, and things got more complicated and blah blah blah, but anyways. So look at Sankeshibun again. So this is how big the article is, and it goes like up here too. And this one is this thin. So still, it's cool that it's on the top page. Basically the same thing, Trump Senpai is now the nominee and Cruz uh, suspending and blah, blah, blah. And nothing there, basically. And But we see the delegates number and stuff. Trump Senpai! Uh, they could have chosen a better picture. So the diplomacy policy that he has, tax, immigration, trades, um, all the things that they uh, he has said, and the schedule, and, um, oh, this is talking about Hillary Clinton, and um, she is not getting votes from the young generation, and males, and those who don't belong to any parties, and things like that. Okay, so let's see how big this is. So this goes here, and then here, and then it goes here, da -da 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 no, 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 so it's, it's huge. This is talking about the LDP politician, again, like, um, being concerned about the security treaty because Trump senpai thinks that it's a free ride of Japan. And this part is saying that uh, he has overcome the Republican Party and stuff. So, Trump senpai. 
And over here are the Trump supporters. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that they have no idea that they are on here, like on the Japanese uh, newspaper. But anyway, so yeah, this is all about the presidential campaign. And it's basically saying that... <laughs> so this is saying that um, Trump senpai is not a professional of politics and um, his extreme attitude is the reason why people like him or whatever. Kind of in a bad tone though, this, of course, because Asahi is a liberal. So this is kind of a bad part where they talk about the um, bankruptcy and um, uh, talking about the, um, like the the fraud of the business or whatever. I'm not really familiar, but see the four times of bankruptcy and stuff. And I'm like, dude, he stood up again and again and again. So it's saying that some people inside of the Republican Party are, are um, feeling threatened by him and stuff. But um, And over here, it's talking about the labor people, like blue color, white people. Um, I'm not really familiar with the term, but um, so it's talking about um, what kind of things that they're, uh, you guys are thinking and stuff. And um, yeah, like the words from the uh, supporters, like, so it's saying like, oh, wake up, Trump is going to rebuild uh, the United States. And also this supporter is angry that the, um, the young Hispanic people are um, using the national flag of Mexico and stuff. And over here, they are saying that um, they're questioning how much money he exactly has and stuff. I'm like, wow, you are so mean. <laughs> so, yep. So, this was the most liberal one. And are you guys ready for the last one? So, it's called Nishinippon Shimbun and it means um, West Japan newspaper. And I don't, I don't know how far... They um, have the service, but uh, it's a local newspaper, I'd say. I think that their business run under Asahi. I am not sure, but they are known as a liberal paper. See, they have the earthquake one, this big, and but still they have Trump Senpai over here. Trump Senpai, you can see that. Oh, many people here. And, um, oh, it's a little different. Clinton and Trump senpai will be fighting against each other and stuff. So that's cool. Yep, it's a narrow article here, like this. And they have two um, articles here inside. Oh, it's colorful here. Yep, so Republican Party, like in, uh, the inside of the party, some people are not supporting him and stuff. And over here, they're saying that the his strategy on media he won and stuff and Cruz is um, suspending his campaign and this is actually big -na 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 -na. this is how big this is so yeah that's kind of cool so basically talking about how the election went and stuff oh look at the face of Trump said bye cool beans and the sad face of Cruz that's sad and over here we have a cartoon of Trump said bye that doesn't look like him or whatever they tried at least so <laughs> it's like anime like Donald Trump uh, 69 years old and then the career uh, his policy family um, what's he's good at like um, speeches and the um, money and things like that kind of interesting okay so um <laughs> This expression is interesting. Like they're saying that Trump senpai is a radical billionaire. Um, <laughs> is it billionaire or a millionaire when it comes to Trump senpai? Can't tell. It's hard to calculate. Anyway, so um, uh oh, it's saying that um he's the way like his tone kind of changed, like he more, sounds more like a president, um, is what this article is saying. But um, here um, they have um, the collection of his comments here. Like in the past, you know, like in the past, he has made like black and white comments, which went kind of um, controversial. And talking about uh, his uh, how he started a business and his um, background of like hosting the TV show. And this is talking about the TPP and um, Japan, US. Alliance, which I am concerned as well. So it's not a bad article here. And this is a list of what he has said about Japan, you know. 
that the the security treaty is unfair and that uh, Japan should um, have a nuclear weapon and that uh, Japan is <laughs> manipulating yen and that um, he is against TPP. Okay, so um, this is as big as this and up to here, here, here. Right. That's all that Nishi Nippon Shimba has. So that's the end. Okay, that was a lot to cover, but um, I hope that you guys were not bored out by this because I can see all these letters in Japanese and I understand, but you guys have no idea what they are, like most of you. So um, I'm sorry for that, but um, I'll try and get better at translations and stuff. And also I need to be familiar with the, you know, the political terms. Isn't it interesting though that um, th these are all about Trump senpai, like most of them. Like I can't imagine, like can you guys imagine our prime minister getting on the newspaper like this? Like I don't think that has ever happened. I mean one, my point is that America is such a huge, like you guys have such a huge impact on our lives and you guys are like your nation is just so powerful and like it, it might have weakened over the years of Obama regime but still like you guys are living in such like the the biggest country basically and um, um, our nation Japan is really close to America so this is what happens uh, when things happen over there and I hope that Trump senpai will stay safe you know, I really hope that all the people around him, like SP, is that English? Um, I hope that those people will do a good job and protect him from whatever um, attacks that he might get. Because, yeah, it's historical. Man, it's historical! Anyways, I'm gonna go now. So thank you so much for watching this long, long video. Again, you guys rock. Like, I really love interacting with you guys. And I really appreciate it that you guys actually care about what I think. It's it's really wonderful. Okay, and then I guess I will talk to you guys later. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye! And I'm sorry my hand is a little dirty, but <laughs> bye. From the ink. Okay, bye. <laughs>